Good morning, beautiful people. I hope you are keeping safe and well. Welcome to my YouTube channel. For those who I haven't met before, I'm Emma Ryder, psychic medium and divine channeler, and this is the Daily Twin Flame Reading. Please bear in mind that as a rule, I tend to read where the Divine Masculine is at and the messages coming through from the Divine Masculine. In no way, shape or form am I saying that this journey is one-sided, as I 100% know it isn't. Please do switch the DM to the DF if that resonates with your journey, okay? Trust your heart. Allow your heart to guide you. Okay, so I'm using different cards today, which I haven't... I don't think I've ever used one of these with the Twin Flame readings, actually. I'm going to use the Angels and Ancestors cards. In fact, I used them for this week's in-depth reading, I feel. I'm not sure. It's been a long week. But hey, let's have a look and see what messages is coming through for today. I feel there's a real need to feel feel the love, feel everything which is happening right now for you. Feel where you're at in your journey. Feel how far you've come. Feel the love which is in front of you. It's time to feel the love. Okay, and the first card out is Embrace <laughs> and Energy of Peace. It's the Broken Arrow okay but not in a bad way it is embracing that energy which is being directed at you and i feel like the broken bit of the arrow is actually almost like a tower point because you have to snap the energy you have to snap open your heart you have to actually you have the the arrow has to go in your heart for you to feel it. Can you feel that love? Take a deep breath and feel the love in your heart. Then we've got the trader card. Exchange energy to create abundance. Because you feeling your love for them and you feeling their love for you, you are exchanging energy whether you realize it or not. And that creates a magnitude of energy. It's like that atomic bomb effect where you're exchanging energy, which is increasing the energy, which is magnetizing it. It's growing. It's expanding. Feel it. That will keep things moving forwards. And then we've got the Star Ancestor card, which says, follow the voice of your soul. And where does the voice of your soul hide? Where does the voice of your soul live? Directly within your heart. It's really about allowing yourself those feelings today. Allowing yourself to be loved and to love. And then we've got Wise One which says grow within your current situation. Allowing yourself to feel grows the current situation, moves things forwards and expands and grows the love you are feeling and you allow yourself to accept. Then we've got the medicine mother. This feels like this week's just been spectacular with readings. I just feel like what is powerful it's different it's deep there's definitely big massive shifts going on medicine mother honor your inner knowing well by how do you honor your inner knowing you feel it today is all about feeling and not being in your head at all just feeling it Then we've got Stargazer, which really feels, because you're feeling this energy, because the energy is expanding, you are rising higher. You are rising towards the stars. Your vibration's getting higher. 
your vibrations getting more magical by being in the now by feeling that can bring miracles then we've got the Shaolin master be graceful in movement and action be grateful for that love follow the action where your heart is leading you I feel like that's what the Divine Masculine is doing today. They're following the love. They're taking action to show that love. Then we've got the High Priest. Intend and create. Your Divine Masculine's intention is to show you this love. It's to make you feel loved. Set your intentions clearly because your divine masculine is definitely setting their intentions very clearly with their feelings. Then we've got the hunter. <laughs> and under the word hunter, it says, track down your fears and your desires. Which feels like your divine masculine is fearing the love but it's also their desire as well because the energy is very similar and they are going to make that desire their reality. They're going to make you a part of their reality. They're going to show you this love. There's definitely this. Showing of love, feeling of love, taking action. Then we've got the moon and it was the full moon yesterday I believe and the moon is all about intensifying energy but also brings the the now is the right time everything's happening in divine time the moon's all about timing now is the right time enjoy it embrace it and know it is real you've worked hard to get to this point and i want to say it's time thank you so very much for joining me Please do like and comment on the video if you feel drawn. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. I truly do appreciate each and every single person supporting the channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Please do take care, stay safe, and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. The maths day. Bye.